Hello friends, welcome back to another video. In this video we will differentiate between Filmora 13 versus Filmora 12. We will talk about their features and usability. Let us first have a quick look at new features of Filmora 13. So without wasting time let's get started. There are a lot of new updates and features, they are, AI power text editing, AI thumbnail generator, AI masking, AI vocal removal, super slow motion, playback speed shortcut, keyframe graph editor and more. First of all let's see the interface. Interface of Filmora 13 is almost same as Filmora 12. There is not much difference in interface. Keyframe graph editor. To use this feature, double-click on the video on Timeline, you will see the keyframe panel, click on it, and inside you will find keyframe graph editor, with this feature you can easily find keyframe of any object, you can also randomly adjust it. In Filmora 12, there is no keyframe graph editor, you can double-click on video and set the keyframes as you want. AI Music Generator Go on the audio section, there is new option AI music, inside it click on tool option, and start, here you can create your own music, select the mood you want for music, select the music type, and number of copies that you want. It will provide you with music you want. In Filmora 12, as we go on audio section, there is no AI music in it. AI Text to Video Generator This is one of the most important feature of Filmora 13. Here you can type the script of your video, you can write any story or video script you want and it will create a video for you. After writing text select the language of your video, then select Aspect Ratio, I will go with 16 to 9. Select the voice and you are done. As you can see that our video has been created. In this way you can use this feature. In Filmora 12, as you can see that there is no such feature in it. VFX Text In Filmora 13, there is new feature VFX Text. Here you will find a lot of visually appealing and captivating texts. You can download and use them. In Filmora 12, there is no VFX Text, you can use simple text and animations in it. Quick 3D Text There is Quick 3D Text option in Filmora 13 you can select and use it. You can modify the text as you want. In Filmora 12, there is also Quick 3D Text option available, as you can see that. Just select it and modify it as you want and use it. AI Vocal Removal It is one of best feature of Filmora 13, you separate audio and background music from single song clip. Double click on the music clip, select AI Music Removal option, this process will start and will be completed shortly. Now audio and background music is separated. Filmora 12 does not have this feature. AI Copilot It is personal assistant in Filmora. You can ask any question related to video editing or about Filmora. Compound Clip You can combine audios, videos, texts and effects on your timeline whether it's on single track or multiple tracks to create a compound clip. For this select clips and right click, then select create compound clip. As you can see our entire timeline is combined to one clip. You can also save it as custom compound clip. You can also switch between main timeline and compound clips. In Filmora 12, you can select the clips and instead of compound you can create a group and move all together. Screen Recorder Screen Recorder of Filmora 12 is shown on the screen, 
it is same as of the Filmora 13. There is no much difference between them. Thumbnail Creator It is one of the new features of Filmora 13. Using this you can create your own thumbnail of the video. I hope you liked the video. If you have any question let me know in comments section. Like, share and subscribe to Jugar Expert for more helpful and informative videos. Thanks for watching.